Hello everyone, welcome back to my video series. I'm Shravan and in this video I'll be talking uh, and going through different examples of uh, the normal forms that we had discussed in our uh, previous video. First normal form. Suppose we have this non-normalized uh, table which has two columns, department name and employee. If you see here in this employee column we have values that are separated by commas. The issue is right there how with this design we have to set you know do uh, like an insert set updates of a single employee we cannot do it um, the it can be resolved by separating those employees in a different columns but if we see in this design we see a lot of null values wastes of desk spaces um, also if a new employee joins the organization the table structure has to be changed, meaning you have to add like E5 here. Um, so, not a good design. So, for a table to be in a first normal form, the values should be atomic. There should be no repeating columns. And then each row should be uniquely identify the key. So, how can we do it? Separate into two different you know, separate into different uh, different tables, departments. So in this, for this, this is as a whole in uh, in a first normal form. We can separate this department, identify with department ID, and then we have a employee, and probably it will have an employee ID, which is primarily uh, a unique key. A second normal form. Um, two things. For a table to be in a first, second normal form, it needs to be meet all the uh, all the rules. It has to uh, meet all the ru rules of a first normal form, and then move the redundant data to a separate tables, and then you have to create relationship within these tables with a primary foreign key relationship. In this table. This is in a first normal form. There's no repeating columns. There's no values separated by commas. All the values are atomic. But these are redundant data, duplicated data. How can we um, resolve this issue? Separate this in a, sing in a different tables, and then establish foreign key. Foreign key. This one is foreign key, and this is a primary key relationship. A third normal form. Um, the table is said to be in a third normal form if it meets all the the rules or conditions of one and f first normal form and second normal form. Um, and then it does not contain a column that are not fully dependent on the key on the primary key. For example, in this table. This is basically in the first meets the first normal form and second normal form rules. No values are uh, separated by column uh, commas. No redundant no redundant uh, columns repeating columns. But there's a problem with this is if you see here, all other columns are dependent with this primary key column and not this one. Yes, so it's dependent on employee ID, that's for sure, but it also dependent on for uh, salary column. You know, if salary changes, this changes too. So you can eliminate the column as a whole and you can actually use, uh, this is a computer value, so you can use, um, uh, you know, some, some SQL statements in a query and then you can find the values from the, it doesn't need, need uh, separate columns in the table. Uh, so this is the end of this video. Okay, I'll see you in the next video.